What's up, Taurus? Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, what's up? Come on in here, hop on the couch, kick your feet up, relax and enjoy yourselves, boo. Grab your weed, blunt, cigarettes, drink fruit, water. Hell, I don't give a fuck, just do you. But allow me to say thank you to all my beautiful subscribers for all the love and support that you show me. Because you don't have two boos and you do. And for that, it truly means the world to me. Thank you, my lovely Taurus. All right, Taurus, we're back with another love ring. And I want your person want to tell you what they want to say to you right now. But first, let me... Get a card from Spirit on what you need to know first. Hold on, let me put get some. Let me get some Florida water first. Hold on for a second. Oh, my love bug. Song that's playing in the background is Shaka Khan. Ain't nobody. So they feel ain't nobody can love you better than them. All right. All right, we got a fire. We got fiery. We got a win-win outcome. Is the forecast? So yeah, wow. Full moon and Libra. Some of you are dealing with a Libra, and it spirit saying it's gonna be a win-win for us. A win-win outcome. Okay, it's the for, forecast. So yep. Whatever y'all doing, even if y'all dealing with a Le uh, Libra, some y'all dealing with a Leo. Even if you're dealing with a Libra, it's gonna be a win-win um, for outcomes. But. In general, you're going to still have a win-win outcome in whatever you're doing. So, that's what's it. But, um, let's see what this person want to tell you. They want to tell you that this person, they, they've been very dishonest, okay? This person been very tricky. Okay? And they broken hearted, okay? They've been feeling a little shattered and broken hearted and shit. You guys may not be talking because they, we found out that they was tricky, a little too dishonest. And now they're broken hearted. Okay? Because they're feeling regret because you guys um, haven't been speaking. Like I said, y'all haven't been talking. So they've been having um feeling um uh, very they've been feeling regretful for what they did. Feeling disappointed by the way they treated you. All right, because yeah, they want a commitment with you. All right. For some of you they want to um get they want to marry you. Okay, they want to propose to you, but for some of you guys, y'all feel better off. Y'all feel happy without them. Or they feel that you're better off without, better off without them. They feel that you're happier without them. That's why the song on by, uh, who's playing now? Uh, Tyrese, how you gonna act like that? You know we just finished making love. You know, you know we be tearing it up and shit. How you just gonna act like that now? Um, yeah, this person is confused because they feel, you know. They feel confused because you feel that, you know, you better off without them. They're trying to make a commitment to you. They choosing to give their heart to you. And they wonder how you up and act, how you going to up and lead them now. You going to act like that, okay? Yeah, they confused because, like I said, they want to establish a family with you. Yeah, you guys are slowly drifting apart. You slowly disconnecting from this person. This is why they're feeling very uh, regretful. Okay, because y'all been clashing too much, just just incompatible and too many conflicts. 
They also could be going through, if this is not you, they could be going through this with somebody else, but, you know. Just apply to your life and lead the rest. Yeah, this person is was a little too shallow, a little too superficial for you. That's why you feel that you're better off. Okay, you're saying no. You you you're making some, you're making boundaries with you made boundaries with this person. Okay, you finally drawing the line. But this person feels that. They fixated on on you and only you, okay? And they want a new beginning with you because they have unconditional love for you, all right? Even though they used to play games and shit and was very unbalanced, they have, you know, clouded judgment. Or they could be unbalanced now that you guys haven't been talking, okay? Yeah, this person was very charming. And gave you a lot of mixed signals, had blocked emotions. But they ready to be loyal to you now. And they keep reminiscing about you and the good times you guys shared and had since you guys said goodbye, ever since you guys said goodbye to each other. Yeah. Let's see who you could be. Let's see what they want to say, what else they want to say to you. Bottom of the deck, we got half my babies. Aww. I have mommy issues. I don't care who you sleeping with, you're still mine. You hear that? You hear that? I'm just kidding. I don't want nobody but you. Aww, Let's see who you could be dealing with. still be anybody so don't get hung up on the cards please it can still be anybody bottom of the deck we got Taurus Saturn Capricorn Earth Taurus Virgo Capricorn Mercury uh who is that I think that's Virgo and um Gemini we got Aquarius Fire Aries Leo Sagittarius Pisces Gemini, Pluto, Scorpio, Sun, Leo, Cancer, and Scorpio. Let me get you an advice card and I'll leave it here. Some of you, you guys, uh, you guys could have been clashing because you had found out they was married to somebody else. That's for some of you, not all of you. It's for some of you. We got hostilities. 26. Let me greet it for you and I'll, read, I'll leave it here. <sighs> Did 
This card shows a man raising his sword in readiness to do battle. Yeah, that's a sword. So some of you are dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right. Um, when it comes up, it reveals a situation where hostilities towards you are about to be or are already been engaged. The aggressive energy may be verbal or emotional with someone in your environment being excessively critical, demanding, or hurtful. In, work, in a work or social situation, there may, may be backstabbing or out and out slander going on. This is a diff this is different from the C card because the hostile energies are more apparent, more overt. In fact, you may have been living with them for some time, but whatever this is, whatever this new or old energy, now is the time to regain control. Allowing dishonoring treatment from others is an open invitation to the universe to send you more. It may feel risky, but you need to have more courage to stand up for yourself now and always. All right, me love. So I'm going to leave it here. And if this resonated with you guys, go ahead and give your girl a big thumbs up. If not, go ahead and give your girl a big thumbs down. I really don't give a fuck as long as you take heed to the what? Message. All right, me love. So thanks for watching. Until next time, same bad time, same bad channel. All right, deuces.